Leo, good morning. Welcome to your reading. Without further ado, let's get into this. What does the sign of Leo need to know, universe? What messages do you have for the sign of Leo, please? What do they need to know about their situation? What's going on for the sign of Leo? Here we go. You have the Four of Cups. What's led to this is the Five of Pentacles. In the past there was the King of Pentacles. Four of Swords is kind of crown in the reading. Hangman is near future. Strength card is in more your energy. The Queen of Cups is somebody you're dealing with. King of Wands. Wow. Wow. You're certainly taking control. Queen of Pentacles, a lot of people around you at the moment. Okay, there's a lot of moon energy around here. There's a lot of confusion, a lot of fear going on. Uh, I'm kind of getting there's a bit of fear of the p future. All right. But what I'm getting is straight off the bat is you've become particularly bored with the situation. Now, whether that's a marriage or, you know, whatever your situation, they're... You've just become bored with it. Okay. I'm not picking up a lot of emotion here in the particular situation that you are in at the moment. You know, you're doing you've been doing a lot of reevaluating and considering your position in life. Okay. Right, but what's led to this is a, a lot of worry, feeling alone. Uh, feeling not really connected to the person you're dealing with in the past you know there was stability here but I'm kind of getting there was a lot of complacency around this you know somebody here was doesn't you know was happy with the way things were but the the kind of overall energy of the reading is you need to take a break need to take a step back you need to rest because this has been very very emotionally draining and i'm kind of i am picking up a separation here i'm getting that you have particularly been building up a lot of courage and through strength and willpower you are making a decision because there's a new opportunity coming in here okay and you see the potential of this opportunity all right, and it could well be in work. All right, this could be a work situation for a lot of you. Okay, changing jobs, better offer coming in. All right, but near future, you know, your perspective is taking big changes. You're viewing after this, you're viewing your considering your position in life, in your situation in a marriage, in work, whatever. Right, I'm kind of getting that you are going to let somebody go here or something. All right, and the reason I say a lot of marriage is because I'm getting that you're dealing with somebody here that is very sensitive, very emotional, but they just don't show it. You want them to be more open. You've certainly been considering your feelings. But I'm kind of getting, instead of being the the lead, you are going to take the leadership role. All right. You're taking your life in your hands. I'm picking up here, there was perhaps in the past a bit of codependency. You know. And it's good here because this is like a hidden sign. I do have two fours here in the minor arcana, okay, which leads to number eight in the majors, you know, plucking up the courage. All right. You're in no rush at the moment. All right. But there is some changes coming in, okay. And a lot of this contemplation that you've been going through in this reevaluation is it's not just in your love life, it's it's in a lot of areas in your life, and it's all about going forward, letting go. Alright. You do think you do feel that between you and somebody things have come to an impasse, you know. 
it's kind of like come to a stalemate. You don't see where you can go forward with this person. Okay, there is a lot of changes coming in. All right, but the outgoing energy is one of stability and planning. Okay. I am even picking up for one or two of you that you could even end up relocating. You're certainly going to change residence, a lot of you. Okay. You've not been truly connected to somebody for a long, long time. Certainly not on the spiritual or emotional level. It could even be purely for convenience. And plus there's work, it's sharing the bills, you know. There's certainly a third party influence in this that's coming in between you two. Okay. And it could even be a new love, somebody exciting. I'm getting here that there is a choice between two situations, two people. Okay. Um, because I've got the King of Wands in and the King of Pentacles, for, for a lot of you, this will be a change of job. Okay. On your personal front, there's, and this could even be a family member. There's the energy between you two is blowing hot and cold all the time. I'm kind of getting for a, one or two of you. There's a parental issue here as well. Mm. Yeah, this is all about you taking the leadership role. Let's get a oracle card on this. Going after what it is you truly want. This is really a journey of self-discovery as well. Well, you, a new start's coming. You're very close to achieving your goal, okay? But with that gibbous moon there, you know, there's, there's a swaying of temperament there's a swaying of emotions okay from your point of view i'm getting what you're about to give up is because you know although there was emotion there that is certainly diminishing you're not as emotionally tied to a person as you once were you're standing in your own power I'm picking up a peaceful resolution. Okay. But, yeah. Your dreams do need a practical plan. It's kind of like taking it step by step. But I am picking up a separation here. Let's get a Angel Answers card. A, a Romance Angels card, sorry. Forgiving and learning. Okay, and that at the bottom there says, as you release and heal the past, you experience more love in, in your present moments. So, you know, this, this is all about release. Okay, releasing the past. Taking control of your life, being optimistic, looking forward. That's not going to be easy, but, you know, it's a kind of, you can take your time. There's no rush. Okay, things are not going to change overnight. Mm -hmm. And it's also about overcoming fear as well, plucking up the courage. Okay, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you very much for watching.